What's up, sons? It's Blind Rod with Son of Tech once again. I just wanted to let you guys know we'll be coming out with videos every Saturday and Tuesday, and that's going to be the current schedule for the foreseeable future. If you just can't get enough of me, check out my live stream over on twitch.tv slash son of a tech underscore. But the topic of today's video is going to be Magic the Gathering Arena. That game has pretty much taken the world by storm, in my humble opinion, and is a ton of fun. But what if you're on the road and all you have is a MacBook Pro? It doesn't actually support OS 10. However, in today's video, we're going to show you guys how to use wine and a special uh, wine skin to go ahead and install MTG Arena on your MacBook. Alrighty, so I found this post on Reddit for a guide to run MTG Arena with Wine on OS X. So we're gonna go through this real quick. It's pretty simple. Of course, the first thing you're gonna need is the MTG Arena setup executable. And a link to the guide will be in the description below if you prefer that method. So you're just gonna go ahead and save the installer from the main MTG Arena website download uh, to your downloads fo folder. And then we are going to move on to the wineskin wrapper that somebody has so kindly already compiled together for us. So clicking on over to there, you'll get sent to a Dropbox. You can just close out of the sign up. You shouldn't need it at this point. And then you're just gonna do a direct download and save that to your downloads folder as well. You want to go ahead and extract out the zip file and then you should see this application called MTG Arena and it'll have the little wineskin logo. Once you've unzipped it, you're just going to want to click it and drag it over to your applications folder. Go over to your applications folder and run the application just by double clicking it. If you get this area, you're going to have to use a right click or two fingers on the trackpad and click open. This should allow you to go ahead and type in your credentials to then open the application. And so now you can see this pop up changes and you can click open. And at this point, you're going to want to hold off real quick before installing software and click advanced. The next thing you're going to want to click is set screen options. And you're going to want to make sure, especially if you're on High Sierra, that you uncheck auto detect GPU info. So at this point we can close out and run it again. And this is where we will install the actual application. We're gonna click install and then click choose setup executable. We're gonna to go to the downloads folder where we downloaded the MTG Arena installer. Select that installer click choose and continue forward. So this is where it's a little funky. You are going to have some weird uh, graphical issues with the installer. So as you can see, you couldn't really see where the, the next button was. So you're gonna have to highlight over that and click next again, click next on through, and then click accept and install. This may take some time, so just be patient and come back when it's complete. So on this screen, it is a little odd, but the finish button and the play button will no longer work typically. Um, so you're gonna want to go ahead and force quit the MTG Arena application. It'll ask you to choose your executable. This is fine at mtga.exe. Uh, Click OK. We're gonna quit out of Wine now, and then we're going to, once again, on the MTG Arena in our applications, open it up. At this point, it should boot mtg arena and download all the files for the first update now currently in the beta for this wine skin the update is broken uh, after the first update or the first initial install so whenever there's an update to magic the gathering arena you'll have to go through and actually uninstall the application again which i'll show you how to do here in just a second Okay, so after all the files have updated and such, you're ready to go. You can go ahead and just type in your birth date and whatever region you're in and click continue and then log in with your account. 
And then ta-da, you now have MTG Arena running on a Mac. It runs pretty smooth on the 2014 MacBook Pro with no uh, additional discrete graphics. It's just the standard i5 that's in here. It runs pretty great. Haven't had any issues. Now on to the issue of the update. So if at some point you start MTG Arena on your Mac and it goes ahead and says this needs an update, please restart the application, it's not going to automatically update. And that's where things get a little bit tricky. Go back to your applications folder and then double click or right click on the MTG Arena application and then click show package contents. From here you can double click wineskin and then it's going to bring the wineskin option screen back up. At this point you can do advanced, tools, and then the uninstaller app. You'll select the MTG Arena and then just click the modify and remove. And once again this portion's a little bit broken so you have to kind of highlight over it to make sure you select the option that uninstalls it. I don't really want to do that right now. But once you've uninstalled it, you'll just follow the process of installing the application once again. Thanks for watching. If you guys enjoyed this type of content, be sure to leave a like and subscribe down below. Don't forget to click the bell for notifications for new videos uh, coming to this channel. And I hope to see you next Tuesday.